guys, how is everybody doing today? Welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. So in this video today, I'm going to review the 2019 BMW M2 competition. So the specific vehicle I have with me here today is finished in the color Long Beach Blue Metallic. It's a very sparkly color and I think it's one of the best color that BMW offers. Um, it has a lot of flake to it and it is shining beautifully today under the showroom's demo lights that we have right here. Now let's do a walk around of the vehicle. Now along the front you guys can see we have the dual BMW M style kidney grills which are black and they're joined in the middle. Now these kidney grills have a party function. They also open and close in order to provide more air to the engine so as to cool it if it needs it. Now if I move down from these kidney grills you guys can see BMW M cars have these three air vents in the front bumper in order to provide more air to the engine if it needs it. Now if the engine needs even more more air then it can get through these air intakes which are on the side of the front bumper now around these air intakes there are these air pocket things which um, which are responsible to flow the air around the car in the most efficient way possible now if I move up ahead you guys can see this vehicle is fitted with the optional BMW adaptive LED headlights now the adaptive LED headlights have these open eye lights and these are very high LEDs and these are these look very cool also now let's move to the side of the vehicle now along the side you guys can see that the M2 has a coupe like roof line now by coupe I mean that the roof line slopes and then merges on with the bootlet itself then we have the fuel filler cap and we all guys also have black chrome paneling all around the window trim right here then this car being an M car also has the wing mirrors of the M cars these are open in the middle and these are double wing then there's also the fender badge with the M2 designation now let's take a look at the top tires. The M2 is fitted with 19 inch Michelin Pilot Super Sport tires. These tires are extra grippy. Now the interestingly this vehicle is not fitted with the competition package rims. It's fitted with the rims from the regular M2 but still they are cool. And then we have blue brake calipers. Alright guys now I have zoomed in on the caliper. You can have a better look. You can see that they are blue in color with the M logo anodized on them. Now let's take a look at the back. Now the back of the M2, you guys can see this vehicle has a really low stance to it. Now let's start at the back with the dual exhaust pipes on it. You, these sound magnificent. Here, take a listen to yourself. Alright now moving aside from the exhaust you guys can see here we have the BMW M2 competition badging right here then um, we have the full LED tail lamps I'm sorry for the close up full LED tail lamps right here we have the license plate and the, uh, then we have the reflector and the parking sensors right here now let's open the boot all right now here it is the boot it's actually pretty large you could fit some suitcases in there now there are some other features such as these tethering points and the neck net right there that's it nothing else right there all right now let's close this boot and let's see what the interior of the m2 has to offer all right now when you open the door of the m2 you will notice that these are frameless doors meaning that there's no frame above the window it's just the window itself the other door panel it's quite normal now let's climb inside now in the interior the first thing you notice is the iDrive touch screen um, which is controlled using this knob we have the gear lever the drive mode selector and up front we also have some cup holders if you want to store some hot coffee of yours then we have red start stop button and digital instrument cluster then we have the m3 spoke steering wheel we have bucket seats which have the m2 logo in it which lights up and we have the black seats all right now the m2 has the iDrive 6 it is not the latest version but it's still pretty good it, the iDrive 6 has this tile format so you guys can see media radio communication cassettes and so on and then you can go on to customize your driver profiles and so on you can control it by a touch screen and you can also use gestures to control it and now on the steering wheel you guys can see we have the two m1 and m2 buttons right here so these can be preset to any driving mode that you want to now here is the air conditioning it's dual zone air c now here we have the gear lever knob to put it into drive you 
press it to the right and neutral is to the left and so is with the reverse here's the handbrake and now let me just open the armrest you guys can see it's a decent height armrest you could fit a couple of your phone in there then the, all right that's about the interior now let's open the hood all right now under the hood first let's talk about the power plant that powers the m2 competition so this is a three liter m twin power turbo inline six cylinder it is a three liter which means 2976 cc and has 405 horsepower at around 5000 to 7000 rpm torque figures are 406 pound feet at 2000 to 5000 rpm and then let's talk about the transmission so the transmission is a seven speed and double clutch transmission with drive logic and I don't know anything about the automatic gear ratio, so I'm gonna skip that. Now, performance. Acceleration 0 to 60 miles per hour, 0 to 100 kilometers an hour, happens in 4 seconds flat in the manual and 4.2 seconds in the automatic, which this speed is. Top speed is electronically limited to 150 miles per hour, or you can increase it to 173 miles per hour. Then fuel consumption, um, I think it's 27 miles per gallon and automatic city is 24 and highway is 34 miles per gallon. So that's under the um, so that's about the power plant. Now, um, as you guys can see on the visuals, um, everything is either carbon fiber or M or M colored black. I think that's what it's called. So yeah, it's pretty smart engine bay, you could say. Okay, guys, that's gonna do it for this episode today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, subscribe, turn the notification bell on, and I'll see you for many more videos to come. Peace.